This crazy idea for Caster Marathon evolved from a 50 year friendship between Charles and Pete and the selfless devotion of Charles to his charities, Fishing for Schools and Castaway. Charles has many times raised funds by running marathons and now, at 70, it was time maybe for a new approach. Pete's a few years older, but he came up with the Caster Marathon idea. The Duke of Northumberland gave them permission to use Sion Park in London and Orvis sponsored the boys by providing the gear. They used a mix of four, six and eight weight single-handed rods with conventional fly lines, along with seven weight spay rods as exhaustion gradually took over. They had a measured 300 yard course on one bank of the lake, the plan being to cast, walk to the end and on again cast, walk until the 300 yards was reached, turn around and go back again. There was lots of laughs and of course with someone trying to handicap Pete at one stage, along with fantastic support from all those who came along to see how we were doing, it was great fun. It really was a hot breezy day and from the 6.30 start it took a total of 10 hours to finish. The amazing statistician was Lee Hooper and he recorded each pass up and down the lake and counted a total of 1,989 casts. In the days after the event, both boys had aches and pains where they'd never thought would have been possible. Bonkers, yes, original for sure. The two near exhausted fly fishers have vowed to never do it again. Definitely though, they will have a new idea to support this special cause 